What's going on guys, it's Chris here and today we are in Tomb Raider, the very original number one Tomb Raider back from back in 1996. Wow, this is an old game and my god, this took me a long time to get it working. <laughs> this was very hard to make work, so I hope you guys enjoy this because it nearly didn't happen. Oh, this was a hard... You, you try and get your Windows 95 game to run on uh, Windows 7. It just doesn't work. <laughs> and it took a while, but, you know, it's working now. So, for this first episode, I think we'll just go around Lara's home for a little bit. Get myself used to the controls a bit. Um, and also just, you know, sort things out. Try and pick things up. Also, I paused without meaning to. Uh, anyway, I think what she would have said was welcome to the home Direction keys, okay, well I'm using them now Okay, the controls are weird, so I'm gonna try and change them and I'm gonna leave it in because I'm a professional Also so people can see my thing also, I don't know if you can see my mouse or not um, I, I It's supposed to be disabled, but it doesn't mean it is also I'm confused. Um <laughs> I used to just realize I tried clicking on something that doesn't have mouse support. Also, oh, that's sound. Okay, you know, I'm going to try and use the controls as they were. <laughs> I'll, see, I'll see how I can deal with them. Okay. Oh, wait, the tutorial. Let's do some tumbling. Press the jump button. Now press the Yay! Button. Press one of the directions and I'll jump that way. I jump forward and back and right and left. That should be it. Okay. Ah, uh, the main hall. Sorry about the crate. I'm having some things put into storage, and the delivery people haven't been yet. Well, you really should have got the move before we started the game. It's the height of unprofessionalism. It really is. I'm gonna run down the stairs in a very boring manner. Now, I don't know if you guys have played any Tomb Raiders at all. And the mansion... Oh, shut up, woman. <laughs> the mansion looks a lot different now. Uh, probably, I'd say probably a lot better. But, you know, it's it's nice to see it in the old way. Although I do prefer it without boxes. And I screwed that up. And I screwed that up. Because I've, I've totally forgotten the controls. But like, it's making me use like directional keys and stuff like that, and like this isn't really stuff people use for games so much anymore. Like games have changed since this one came out, so it's a little bit confusing, you know. <laughs> I'm I'm used to sort of more modern controls, and it's a little bit hard. Right. I prefer it as a ballroom. What's the exercise? I don't actually run everywhere. When I want to be careful, I walk. Hold down the wall like this. And walk to the right. With the walk button down, I won't fall off, even if you start the maintenance. If you want to look around, press and hold the look button. Then press in the direction you want to look. I don't know what the look button is, so I'm going to move on. And hold, yes! Oh! <laughs> I grabbed it and immediately fell off. I'm guessing it's off here. What's this? To, to where? I got it. I can't believe I actually got that. I'm confusing myself here. Right, this is a really big one. To do a 
same jump exactly as before, except while I'm in the air, press and hold the action button to make me grab the ledge. So jump back, forward, jump, and action. Got it. Okay. That was easy. Even from this. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was not what was planned. Um, you have to be like perfectly on with these, otherwise it just doesn't work, which is quite infuriating. So it turns out if you let go of um, control, that she just falls off. Uh, that's kind of a fail on their part there. Immediately press and hold the action button, and I'll grab the ledge on the way down. Well, the story for this game was absolutely fantastic. If you want to get this game at like a more modern version, get um, Tomb Raider Anniversary. Fantastic game, fantastic story, and but with the modern controls. It's a brilliant game, but it's it's aged. This was one of the first games up oh, shut up. I know this by now. Whoop! In the water and I'm underwater, I don't know how to get up. Oh jump button. Okay. Oh, air. Just use forward and left and right to maneuver around on the surface. Press jump to dive down for another swim about or go to the edge and press action to climb out. Now for nineteen ninety six this game was revolutionary. I, I know you look at it now, sort of 2013. Oh, shut up. From yeah, 2013 to 2014 audience, or, or even beyond, but... Oh, I'm finished, okay. <laughs> I guess that's it for this episode. <laughs> okay, I didn't know that. Um, well, you know, yeah, yeah, I guess that's good, but... I guess next episode we'll tackle the actual main game. As I was saying, this game was revolutionary for its time. Um, but that's something I'll go into uh, more detail next time. So, um, you know, until then guys, as per usual, uh, like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys then. Ciao for now.